a little boy that I knew in high school, went to school with my kids, just a regular old kid around town. And, and of course now um, that they're older, I'm hearing all the stories of just what they did in high school. <laughs> and what, uh, Lisa and I have been cooking, we've been, uh, we, we, of course, now we understand what all the stories, we understand what's happening. Yeah, where our kids were. We were either her house or my house. So this little boy grew up to become Captain America. And it was one of the most generous and kindest people I know. Uh, has never turned me down when I've asked him if he can. He's not in, you know, shooting bad guys up and you know, someplace in the world. He's never said no. And so this year, we wanted to give our leadership award to Chris Evans, uh, Captain America, a superhero he, like you don't, like you can't imagine. We're gonna find that word. Uh, Chris is actually in filming Captain America 3 right now and can't be here, but I'd like to introduce you to his mother, Lisa Evans. Um, come on up. is, Mom, I can never say no to Joyce. Joyce will say, Chrissy, you, would you mind giving me a poster? Sure, I'll give you a poster. Well, would you give me two? Sure, I'll give you two. Would you come over? Yeah, I'll come over. Well, would you meet some people? Yeah, I'll meet people. And then I'll get off the point, Mom, I just committed for you know, the next 10 years of my life to Joyce. In fact, I too run a nonprofit. I also am an executive director of a nonprofit. And this past January, Joyce and I happened to have events on the same exact night, and guess where he went? <laughs> yeah. It's okay. It's okay. Um, he is, um, you know, all of who is directly confused, they want to grow up to be superheroes. And he was not. But I'll tell you right now, and he says this every day, he's not a superhero. He gets paid to pretend to be a superhero. The superheroes are the people that Mr. Saved. They're Kim. They're Emma. They're all of the families at Mr. Saved. And we're just lucky, thrilled, blessed, couldn't be happier to be part of it. And we're here for a really long time. And every time he can suck in another one of his friends, like Chris Pratt. So the onus is on all of the Boston sports teams, because if you've ever seen my son in an interview, you know what a freakazoid he is about Boston and sports. He has two homes here, plus my own. Um, and he's constantly making sport bets, which is how we got Chris Pratt to come to Christopher Saban and, and how we did all that because, um, so um, that's, you guys gotta do this again. Um, he'll be betting with somebody and hopefully we could um, destroy my son-in-law, the Yankee fan, in the, in the, in the, in the two thirds of us. Um, but thank you all. He would be here if he could. He's in Atlanta. Oh, you have the video. That's right. So, he's very, um, yeah, now we're for Chris Evans. <laughs> 